Hey everybody, Jerry's here with two more Pokemon Shield on the last episode. Um, we fought some Dynamax Pokemon, we also battled it out with Morimoto, and that guy was extremely tough. After that battle was done, we got Keiko to evolve, and now Keiko has become the almighty Hydragon. Now later on, I am going to have to fix the IVs on this Pokemon, um, because as you can see, uh, Keiko's got some attack IVs, some defense IVs. Um, it, it's kind of widespread, right? So it's kind of all over the place. We have a bunch of IVs that we don't necessarily need. And the IVs is the... Um, that little orange uh, shape in the middle there. It's kind of, I don't know what kind of shape it is, but... You see the yellow on the outside, and then you see the... The orange in there, and the orange in there is the IVs they've gotten. So you could, as you can see, Gallade's barely been used. And because of that, Gallade barely has any EVs right now. Um, and then when it's whited out like that, that means their EVs are full. They're done. We've done so many battles with Freya. Uh, so many with Steelia. So many with Jerry. So many with Tim Tim. We've maxed out their, uh, their EVs. And uh, Tim Tim's EVs and speed and attack are not bad. I actually kind of like those. The rest are... Uh, are kind of a waste right now, but this isn't even a, a perfect Tim Tim, so it doesn't matter. Um, later on, we are going to reset Keiko and fix Keiko, so I'm not really concerned. It's just when I, once I get to that part of the game and I'm able to do it, that's when we will do it, you know? So, <sighs> let's continue on with our story. We are battling, a, I'm pretty sure it's over here. This is the Dynamax spot. Oh yeah, Kabu's gym. We'll be, we'll be battling. We, we went. We came to this gym because um, there was a person here that said they wanted to speak after I became the champ. And then I became the champ. And then they just wanted to teach me a move. Very strong move. Um, but not one I want to learn at this moment. I'm glad you remember me. Of course I do. You two were red hot after all. I'll never forget seeing you off after you've completed your first leg of the gym challenge. Don't think we really got the time for the friendly chin wag. Right, actually, the situation's gotten pretty bad over at the stadium. Yeah, that'd be where, why, uh, why we're here. Brilliant, the opponent's a bit much to take on single-handedly, so I was wondering what to do. With all you at my side, my confidence in this battle is burning brighter by the minute. Let's begin. We'd look like brothers if I kept his uh, shirt on. I think I'm gonna look into changing my hairstyle when we're done here, because I don't want to be seen as that uh, that guy in prison. I don't want people thinking I'm Rose's son or something. Um, so we got Jerry out of here. Not very, not a very good choice. Not versus Turkle, anyway. Um, so what we're going to do is... <laughs> we're uh, we're going to U-turn out of here. <laughs> um, snipe shot. Ooh, that's going to do some decent damage. I think that's a water, too. A water, water move, too. Let's get that U-turn going. And get out of here. Let's enjoy... It won't be super effective or anything, but let's enjoy some Keiko here. We're going to Dynamax as well. Boom Shakalaka with the... Ooh, little chop. Not bad. And a crunch. That's clever. Max flared off probably for me. Oh, no. Wow. Almost one shot appears. It's because the sun is out. Oh, I lost my Dynamax. I should have did it on the first turn. Um, I guess what we can just do here... Uh, do I want to do I want a nasty plot? Let's feel what a regular dragon pulse is capable of. Oh, Dyna top is Dynamax. He stole my Dynamax. It's actually better he Dynamaxes because he has the type advantage. This is totally okay. He's gonna go before me too. Oh no! Wow, dragon pulse hitting for major damage. This geyser is going to be great because it's going to nullify some of his fire damage. Because it's going to make it rain. Um, so that 50% boost to fire damage 
it's actually gonna go I think you do half fire damage when it's raining so that boost is actually oh it's kind of brutal <laughs> um, let's see what he does he's probably gonna do a max he did an iron tail Wow it's almost like he knew what was coming um you know we'll just do another dragon pulse for the stab damage it'll probably end this battle you guys can see Keiko um, you know they became probably one of the strongest members on the team right away and I think it's mainly due to their perfect IVs looks like we were able to extinguish things this time I'll let this Pokemon rest here in Motostoke till it gets back its energy you should you sh should you have need of help please do not hesitate to ask Oh, I forgot to take a look at Milo's League card. This is going to be the chance to look at everyone's League cards. I forgot all about that. Then after that, I'm going to go change my hair before I forget. I don't want to look like that dude in prison, man. Don't worry, I know you all have more work that needs to be done. Go forward, youths. I wish you well. Dude, always exercising. Let's go take a look at those League cards. Forgot all about that. Then I gotta update my uh, my look here. So Kabu, okay, let's compare it to the old one he gave me. Oh, it looks the same. Wait, what? Oh, it has a different glow on it. Oh, this is like a regular glossy and over here is like more holographic. I see it on the top corner and the bottom right corner. It's like little sparkles, like a shiny Pokemon, okay. Milo, same deal. He's got the square holographic. Oh no, he's, his card's completely different. What? Why did Kabu get, uh, get gypped here? I love Kabu's signature because it looks like a real one like some crap I would do. <laughs> oh god, dude, Jeff. Oh, this is the dude, this is the dude that traded me the, uh, uh, Keiko, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. This is the dude that... Thanks, buddy. He's got a cool card, too. He's got the shiny, uh, just like Kabu, the stars. Uh, we got Piers. We haven't gotten a new Piers card. I guess we're eventually going to get everyone's new cards. Let's go upgrade our hair. I think it's down over... Not not that way. I had to go. I had to take the elevator. Here we go. We'll go downstairs. We'll do our hair now. I can't be looking like uh, Rose's son. I can't do this. That guy's in prison. I'm gonna think I helped him with those deeds. I don't need that. Out of my way. Oh, uh, that's close. Here we go. Here we go. Boom shakalaka, baby. I need some new hair. Hey, what's up, champ? Here's $3,000. I've been very spendy with the money lately. I did like this hair a lot. Hunk, ha, hawk? Oh no, I don't want that. I don't want the man bun either. What did I used to have? Undercut is what I used to rock. I don't mind having undercut again. The Caesar cut. This is more like what I have in real life. I like to get my fade. I like the fade, but I also think the undercut looks pretty cool for a, for a character in a game. My character looks like he has a fade right now, just with long hair at the top. I'm gonna go with the undercut. This is the one I initially liked. And if it looks weird, I'll go back to the rose hair. <laughs> if I find I don't like it anymore, I don't mind. It's like the rose hair, except I slicked it back with gel. Let me see how my lead card looks. This is gonna, this is gonna decide big time how I feel about this. Oh, it's not bad. It's not bad. Hey, I got five stars now. Let's go. I wonder what the stars mean exactly. So we have six shiny Pokemon found. And I have a total of 232 Pokemon caught? Is that what my deck says? I don't have 200 yet. 
What do I have on my decks? 183 is what I've caught. Okay. Gotcha. Should I try the fade? I almost never see people with the fade. Wish you could see the hair before you buy them. Whatever, if I don't like the fade, we're gonna... We're gonna try it out. See what it looks like on the lead card and all that. And if I'm unhappy, I'll put the uh, undercut back on. Go ahead and reprint my card. I don't like it. We're putting the undercut back on. I just wasted six grand. And I may, you know, at, at some point I may go back to the to the rose hair. I don't know, man. It was a really nice looking hair. And it looked good on my leak card, too. Let's go ahead and reprint that. I was happier with that on my lead card. Yeah, this one in the in the rose here is not bad. I might maybe I'll go back to the rose here someday. But right now we're gonna take a little break from it. Um, okay. So Oh yeah, can't I wear hats now? Ah I think I could wear hats now. I think the rose here doesn't let you wear hats. Let's see what kind of hats you got. Oh yeah, I can wear hats again. I can get a bucket hat. A sports cap. I could be the champ. Hmm. Almost makes me want to travel around and see what, what good hats they have. Yeah, we're done shopping for now. I don't think I have any good hats on me. That's okay. We'll just go ahead to the next thing. As we travel around, we'll uh, look for hats and stuff like that. That's cool. I do have the option for hats. Um, so next is Holbury. We might just open up here with Keiko. Because it looks like it's just... Um, oh, whoops. Because it looks like it's just Pokemon that want to battle. It's not necessarily... You're not getting any money from this. You know what I'm saying? And I want to change this outfit too. I don't like it anymore. I don't like the brown. Looks like I crap myself. Alright. Nessa. Alright, so we'll be up against some water Pokemon. Things are pretty dangerous here. We know the situation. Are the staff and spectators alright? Yes, they took shelter just a short while ago. The more I look at you three, the more I see how odd a little group you are. What? <laughs> Pierce is like, leave us alone! We came here to help. And I'm grateful for it. The Dynamax Pokemon's power is so intense, I'm sure it'll give me trouble. I feel a lot more confident about it if you all join the battle. Let's do it. It's weird, because at the end, they just keep the Pokemon. I don't get to capture it or anything. Whoa, Gyarados. What? This isn't your usual... Oh man, she's got a good Pokemon out for this. That rock is gonna do good. We had an electric type. My attack falling is not a big deal. Oh man, if Steelio was here. <laughs> Get that defiant boost. But nope, not gonna happen. We're actually gonna be the one to power up. We're gonna lower their attack stat as well, because Gyarados is very strong physically. You know, I'm not I'm digging this hair, man. It's not bad. When I get a hat on here, it might look cooler. I gotta see if they have a poison hat. Oh baby. Where did I buy this clothes? They might have poison hat at the gym people. I'll check at the counter when we're done here. I don't know if they sell hats. But I know that's where I got the poison outfit from. Max Geyser. Is that for me? No. Poor peers. I swear they hit peers every time they they can. They they just go right for them. That warm wind here. The special damage one. Oof. And it lowers its attack stat. So that's a win-win. We got the snipe shot. Wow, that actually 
not very effective and it still does good damage. Hop, I don't know where you're getting this damage from, honestly. Rock Tomb, that's a good one. Okay, we is that lower to speed too? Wow, okay. We should be able to end this on the next turn. That speed reduction did a big uh made a big impact. Oh, this is over. This is over. You're not Well, they might defeat Piers, but Snipe shot, not even! Wow! Oh, that Gyarados got crashed. I'm so not used to these Mega Raids going this smoothly. Nessa with a Gyarados sounds scary. Does she use that the next time I battle her, probably? I'll keep that Pokemon at Stadium until it can fully recover? What does that mean? If you need my help, let me know. We got her lead card, too. I suppose I'll see you later then. Thank you so much for your help, truly. Okay. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. Your old on phone's ringing. We've got trouble. Those two weirdos have showed up at the lab. Oh, my lord. They keep rudely demanding I hand over wishing stars. I'm all... I'm all right for now, uh, but get over here quick, okay? They're real creepy. Oh, wow, I can't believe they went and attacked Sonya. We gotta get back to Sonya. Let's hurry to the lab. Run, Piers, run! He, he really doesn't think anything through. Sure does make him seem a proper fool. Guess the word would be reckless. <laughs> We're headed to the lab next, right? Guess I'll stick by you till we see this through. Piers? Very, very awesome. Do they sell hats here is the question. Oh, they only sell whole outfits. Oh. If I was going to switch my outfit, what's pretty cool? Mm, I've always liked the steel one. Uh, rock uniform. Fighting uniform actually looks cool. I dig the colors. I don't know if I want... Ah, oh, man. I was hoping they'd have a hat, too. Yeah, no hats. You can't go left and right in here at all. It's either you buy the whole uniform or you just you just don't get it at all. Uh, thanks for coming. Well, you know, no, no problem, lady. We're gonna be alright. I don't think I need any items. We bought a bunch of potions last time. Whoops. Oh, we're gonna probably, if they're there, we're probably gonna have to battle. So let's get Jerry up front. Oh, if it's a double battle, though. Let's let Keiko enjoy some double battle action. Let's go ahead and fly down over there. We're coming, lady. We're coming. We're gonna save the day. Okay. Oh, yeah, this outfit's gotta go. Alright. I wonder if I do Hydreigon colors, will it consider uh, the shiny? Uh, we know all the wishing stars that Chairman Rose had gathered are here. We're celebrities. We know everything. We have an enhanced level of insight <laughs> into such things. You non-celebrities are not suited to having such valuable things. Hand them over to us, you poor people. You don't deserve anything. Give it to the rich. Dude, this voice I'm pulling. You know, oh my god, have you guys played Skyrim? This is like two Ciceros talking to each other. The Night Mother, and you're the listener. <laughs> Wishing stars and being a celebrity have nothing to do with each other. I don't know how you knew about this, but there's no way we're giving them to you. They're sitting there relaxing, drinking tea and cookies. You can never understand how important these stars are. You have no need for them, you rich people. Goodness, whatever shall we do, younger brother? Well, older brother, it seems to be an inconvenience. <laughs> we're so rich. Sonya and the professor are the ones who'd be inconvenienced here. Hop! 
forcing Pokemon at Dynamax against their will, you've gone way out of bounds. And I haven't forgot about getting back the Rusted Sword either. Well, 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 brother. I thought the champion would come, but I didn't think a loser would follow. Thus I have you once again taste the flavor of a humiliating defeat. We've purchased even more expensive Pokemon. The last ones were only one million dollars each. Don't let these goons put you down. That's right. You lost a battle, but don't lose that rockin' spirit. We'll fight them together. Thanks, mate. First things first, let's get these weirdos out of here. Weirdos? Oh, how they wound me, older brother. To be called such a terrible a thing as weirdos by these peasants. Indeed, brother. To address royals such as ourselves in such a matter cannot, will not, be forgiven. This time I've brought much stronger Pokemon to thoroughly trounce you with. We will attack you with the richest of the richest. If he has a Meowth with Payday, I'm going to pull my hair out. Okay, Bronzong. Okay, this is... This is not bad. Not bad. Hop, that's bad. Okay, Hop, that's bad. But what they did, not bad. I'm going to Brave Bird that thing. I just don't like it. Goodbye, Golosapod. Oh, well, that was a $2 million Pokemon right there. Defeated by the champ for free. Haha! <laughs> Getting your butt whooped for free. Don't you love it? Double edge. Wow, you didn't do Cotton Guard? You always do it to me, you bum. Not that it would matter in this case. Extra Sensory. Wow, a lot of damage. Critical hit, of course. Poor Hop. Doughblade. Wow, when they evolve that, I'm going to have a lot of trouble. Um, let's go ahead. It's a U-turn. I'll let Keiko have some fun here. Keiko's new. Keiko's fresh. Um, she hasn't gotten to do much yet, you know? We recently evolved her, but we haven't done real battles yet. See how this goes. Double kick. Hop, you just really love losing. You absolutely, that's your dream in life is to just lose every battle you get into. Here's a sacred sword. If you did Cotton Guard, you might have survived that. The extra sentry, no, but. Oh well, whatever. I guess the argument is if he did Cotton Guard, he would have never got that damage off on Bronzong. Um, let's see, what, I actually, this was a horrible decision on my part, let's do a nasty plot, and Kate goes faster than them, uh, than them as expected, what are they gonna do, snipe shot, whoa, oh, wow, really good damage, that's gonna hurt, Shadow Claw, that for me too? Okay. Whoa. That Dough Blade's hitting extremely hard. We're gonna see, are we faster? We are faster. It doesn't affect Dough Blade. Ah, oh, good lord. But it finished off Bronzong. I didn't even read that. Jeez, I should've read. I could probably set up one more turn. Eh, it's not a big deal. It's not gonna hurt anybody. We're at 100 attack with Gallade. Gallade, are you going to be stronger than Freya, uh, not than Freya, than Steelia in the next 31 levels? We can hope. Snipe shot coming in. This reminds me of Sniper from Yu Yu Hakusho. He just flicks his finger. 
This Inteleon is putting in so much work. Wow. Like a lot more work than I've done. I've done almost nothing next to this now. Inteleon doing really well. Cling Clang, oh my god, they have all these tanky Pokemon. I've definitely got the wrong Pokemon out here. A fighting type would dominate here. We're just gonna do a Hyper Voice. It hits them at least. It's not gonna defeat anyone, but it at least hits them. Wow, half damage to Bisharp, almost half to, to Kling Clang, not bad. This Inteleon's a beast, wow. I think I need to build one up, man. If Hop is doing this much damage with his, imagine one that a player trained one could do. Oh, it's squishy though. But it makes up for the squishiness by doing big damage. Something my, uh, my Zaza was lacking, my damage was not as big. And some of those hits were neutral too. Okay, wow, you got a Corviknight, which is cool. We're gonna go for a Dragon Pulse here. Again, they resist it, but at least it's stab on my part, and I'm plus two. Nice. What are they, what are they gonna do, Drill Pack? Probably a Drill Pack or something. Freya level 70, Gallade at 40. Those are some... Pretty good stats on Keiko. Pretty decent stats on uh, Gallade, too. Scary fate. <laughs> Phalanx. Oh, wow. The last Pokemon is a Phalanx. Corviknight. Do Brave Bug, my child. See if it goes down. Perfect. As you can see, Keiko's out here just knocking him out. Her power is really new to me, because I haven't seen what a Hydreigon can do on this game. So actually seeing it now, I'm kind of testing its limits to see what it can destroy. To be fair, I was plus two, but... Quite a fixing predicament indeed, older brother! Younger brother! This is some kind of mistake! Here's $49,000, peasants! Go buy yourself a new life! We won! Oh, that's Hop. <laughs> the exquisite Pokemon we trained actually lost! <laughs> you only won because you two teamed up. Still, we awfully, you ruffians are praised. You guys teamed up too, I want to hear it. There we go, Piers! Oi! The two of you teamed up, too. <laughs> Give back the sword and stop forcing Pokemon to go all crazy. I like how the assistant popped up in the back. Sorry, is this a bad time? My apologies for the intrusion. Those men are dangerous. Be careful. Well done. Oh, well done. Oh, Sonya got gypped. You're... Your infiltration mission was a resounding success, it seems. Have you gathered the wishing stars, peasant? I mean, uh, Waka Bee? Yes, thanks to the master swordward ensured but buying me so much time. I can't believe this. Give the, give back those wishing stars. Oh dear, it would seem we've been completely had. <laughs> Why, this moment is so sweet. I don't think I'll need any sugar in my tea later. Oh, bathroom with you was just a little trick. We'd won before you'd grabbed a single Pokeball. And with that, farewell. They ran off. Oh, God. Why? I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't cut it, lady. Was everything, was it all a lie right from the start? There was no helping it. It was necessary for the plan. Our plan to put Galar under the control of the royal lineage once again. My character is just smiling. Dude, things, bad things are happening. So those two weren't 
working alone. One of their followers even betrayed Sonya. That's real rough. I think she's gonna need some cheering up from her real friends. Seems that lot that have sent in a back up all their big talk. Okay. Okay. She does not want to speak. All right, I'm out of here. And that, that's that. Oh, here we go. Don't just leave without saying anything. Lady, I tried speaking with you three times. We didn't want to say anything to make it worse. We're trying to be considerate. Of course I'd be down to myself. It was my fault. I got tricked by a nicket in Wooloo's clothing. But that's it. No more feeling sorry. That lot made off like bandits with all the wishing stars. It'd be awful if they were used for some evil purpose, so there's no time to be feeling down. You got some guts, lady. You've certainly grown strong in the face of adversity, dearie. Gran. Dynamaxing draws out the true strength from the trust between a Pokemon and their trainer. But that group is likely pouring the Galar particles emitted by the Wishing Stars into Pokemon, forcing them to Dynamax. Indeed, what an awful thing to do to Pokemon. The theft of the Wishing Stars was just the start. Things could get a lot worse from here on. But why? What reason could they have for forcing Pokemon to Dynamax? Those weirdos said they wanted to reveal the true natures of Zacian and Zamazenta. I'm curious about what my former assistant said about a royal lineage. Does she mean it literally? Look at your town map. There's huge reactions of four stadiums. They certainly get around, don't they? If there's trouble at the stadiums, then Marnie could be in a real bad way. Spike Muff seems to be okay. There's no power spot stadium there. Um, right. <laughs> Every time something bad happens, he thinks about his sister. Typical big brother trouble. Uh, there's no time to be lying about. Pokemon are in trouble. Why are we still here? Let's get right out there and lend a hand. I'm sorry to leave it. To, uh, all, all to you, but you'll have to take care of the Dynamax Pokemon. I'll search for those Sword and Shield Weirdos in the meantime. She said that last time, and she didn't find them. They found her. <sighs> Lady. Okay. I was gonna go heal at the Poke Center, but what is uh, the next town? Okay, Hammerlock. Guess we'll do that. It's probably a big dragon type. I could probably... Hmm. It's a big dragon type. Then we can have Keiko handle it in the front. Let's go for a quick heal because we did lose some power points. what i think i remember here's the shop so i need battle points what i really need are these items the power items and i'm also gonna need a destiny not for breeding uh hp up two battle points each Ugh, that's a lot that's like 52 battle points to max out one stat on one pokemon like as much as a nature uh mint Mm, well, this is more bang for my buck. The nature mints are great, but I don't know. I definitely need a master, a destiny knot, and I think attack for sure, special attack. The most important ones to me are pow uh, so power anklet, power lens, and power bracer. So I just got to make sure I have at least 30 in there. Um, for when I do start breeding and stuff. Did I heal my Pokemon? God, I don't remember. I did heal him, okay. Alright. Let's go ahead and do this. What are you doing here? Oh, so, someone saw the weirdos and they said they got through the door. The door's closed with an electric lock. Opening might take time. 
Huh. I guess we'll... Alright, so we eventually are gonna come back here. We probably have to clear all the uh, Dynamax places. Nice timing! The stadium's just about reached its limit. There's simply too many Dynamax Pokemon running wild in there. The wishing star power is being used for some evil purpose. So that's what's caused all this. There's a problem, alright. Before we get that sorted, we gotta do something about these Dynamax Pokemon. Glad we got you here. Though, we've already done the bulk of the work. Yeah, let's go help us. We'll take care of this. Leave it to us. We got an unbeatable team. <laughs> I don't know about unbeatable, but we have a good team. Especially you, Piers. The way you battled me in the Champion Cup. Well, he had my Dynamax Pokemon up against the wall. Things might actually go better this time if we split up our little band. Everyone split up so we can each take down one of the Pokemon. Let's do it. Okay, so we're gonna... Wait. So it's gonna be 2v1? Two, two uh, oh, crap. Oh, bro. Oh, snap. Okay. Uh, wait, where is everybody else? Why am I alone? I'm alone? Okay, I understand I'm the champ, guys, but good lord, it's a hack service. Keiko, that beast ball looks so cool. Keiko, please one-shot this hack service. I believe in you. Your special attack is so high, it'll be even higher when we properly EV train you. To get Keiko to 100, you guys are going to see some terrifying power. Alright, Keiko. Do your thing. Oh! Ooh! 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 So, what was it? Piers, Hop, and, uh... Piers, Hop, and Raihan, they took on one by themselves? Or did all four of us each get one? Really got me out of a tough spot. I better snap a quick one to remember this victory. So, it looks like we all took on one, maybe. Okay. Give me a ring if things going uh, should go to pot again. Right, that was definitely the fastest one. I'm always happy to lend a hand if I can. The great Raihan is here for you anytime. You and I have got to battle again. This time, no Dynamaxing for either of us. Wow, Raihan, that's good to have a, a fair battle. Why does Piers look embarrassed? I assume you are looking, ready looking for who's behind it. Carry on, then. I'll take care of things here at Hammerlock Stadium. Nice. So the reason those red and blue buffoons can make so many Pokemon Dynamax is because they hoarded up so many wishing stars. Things will probably get even tougher from here. We still got three more stadiums where there's some Dynamax Pokemon running wild. Let's up the tempo. All right. I'll be back, Sonya. <sighs> okay, that was actually really fast. Okay, so we got one, two, three. All right. Guess we'll do uh, Stone Side next. That's the ghost town. Oh, doesn't this guy? He sells things. Looks like you became the champ. It's an achievement. Oh, he gave me. Oh, nice. I remember this dude sells thing. He just gave me a beast ball for free. Today's bargain. A magnet. I'll buy it. Okay. Yeah, if you come here every day, you can get like a rare item. What's the next bargain? Mystic water. Alright. I'm buying a comet shard for 30. Looks like you bought what I need. Yeah. I think this guy, the comet shard, I mean, is he offer if he's offering that, he probably probably like a junk or something. Let me see. What did I just sell you? I hope it's not a rare item, dude. Comet Shard? It's probably a treasure, I can hope. Oh, it might not have been a treasure. I don't have one. Oh, what did I sell this guy? I saw $30,000 and I said, let's do it. <laughs> oh, God. Um. So, Beast Ball, that's pretty cool, man. 
it looks awesome. So, all right. Well, that's that was nice. Let's go uh, take on this gym here. I may I might need to go to the room, uh, the move raider, and see if I can fix Hydragon. I think there's some moves we haven't learned, or because what am I? Maybe when it's a uh, no, actually we leveled this thing up from level one. I think. Crap! I guess I didn't miss out of moves. I don't know. Maybe the rest of the moves are TMs. So we came to help. How are things looking? The people all got out, but I'm the gym leader. I'll I'll battle the Dynamax Pokemon. Then let's all work together. Th that'd be brilliant. Thanks. There are loads of them. I hope everyone can take one each, please. Let's go. The way his eyes turn on. I want his mask. If I could get his mask, I'd probably use it. So one each. It's probably a ghost Pokemon. And it is. A dusk. So is it is its real eye that light up there? Or is it the two things on its chest? Because that's like its mouth. It's an interesting Pokemon. I've actually never really figured it out. I mean, it would make sense to me that the one eye is up there at the top. Um, but then it would be kind of freakier, you know, if the eyes were on its chest there. But we have to Dynamax no matter what. So let's just Wormwind it. Wormwind it and go for the gold, baby! You must fall, Dynamax Pokemon. Keiko coming in hot. See how much damage we do with this. Half of its health in one go, baby. Oh no, this is gonna hurt. Okay. That was super effective, really. Well, I think they, they have to make these easy on purpose because you're by yourself. So it's probably doing like a quarter of its damage that it normally do. Maybe less. Oh my god, one health, man. Like, are you serious? Thunder. What? That did, like, five damage. Did I get paranoid? Oh, no, the hail. He, oh, he, he defeated himself with his own hail. <laughs> he thought he had me. Thanks a lot. The Pokemon have all calmed down. They can rest here. They should be fine in time. My league card. Here you go. Oh, I gotta check out the new Lee cards. I haven't looked at uh, Nessa's or anyone else. You can leave things here to me. I'd rather go help those who need you. I'd rather you go help those who need you. Okay. So we got like one more location to check out. We've gotta go help all the other places where these Dynamaxing Pokemon are running wild. Looks like there's two stadiums left to check. All right. But before I do that, we gotta check out these Lee cards. So here's new Nessa. Okay, this is definitely different. This is like model Nessa. Where's the old one? Yeah, we got gym battle Nessa. And boom, then we got Victoria's Secret Nessa. Bum, 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 bum. All right, Kabu. Alistair. Oh, with the mask off. Okay. Very, very uh, nervous kid. Let's take a look at his old one. Ah, it's like a ghost. And we got Raihan here. I think this is a different one too. So he's got like hearts in his background. Let me see what mine... Oh, wow. I see. Cool. How do... How, if you do sort, what happens? Newest first. Old one special. How you met. I guess we'll leave it the way it is. That's okay. 
I might need to... When I fly to the next town, I probably have to heal. Because, uh... We are taking some damage. Ice? Ugh. Fairy. That's Fairy Town. Ugh, they're both bad. Let's just do the ice one real quick, and then we can put... Da, 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 Jerry up front. So we'll do that. Why, why make myself suffer? Oh, I'm at full health. Did they heal me? No. I'm not healed, but since Jerry's up front, we don't need to heal anymore. Right. Bob's Burgers. Get out of my way, man. Move! Okay... After this, we just have Glimwood next. Get to safety, you three! Who'd you think you're talking to, then? We're here to help, not be helped. Oh, it's you three. I was a little too into things and didn't notice right away, I'm afraid. Ah, Jerry's is here, so everyone can relax. There appears to be no less than four Dynamax Pokemon. I was just going over a plan on how to handle things. So far, everything's pretty, uh, pretty simple. You know, you go to a place and they each have one Dynamax. So you just one if you want it. Are you ready? Okay. And I probably don't even need to switch Jerry from being up front, because I can just keep it going for the next... For the fairy Pokemon, Jim, this is ice. Yeah. Uh, ice ghost. Ice ghost. Do ghost resist steel? I never considered that. Eh. I don't, I don't think they resist steel. Nope. Not this one. Jerry, get bigger. And eliminate him. Show him just how tough a steel bird can be. I wonder if there's any interaction between Corviknight and Skarmory. Seeing as they're both steel flying types. Alright, here we go. Max Lightning! Oh. Okay. Okay, we're starting off fantastic. This is a weird Pokemon to just see here out in the wild, though. And what are they just doing, like, popping up at the gym? Do they live at the gym? Oh, oh, oh you're you're about to get one shot at Tweety. You're, oh, so close. Our defense went up. It's not really relevant. Just do another spike here. Thunder. <laughs> oh, they should have just did another max lightning. I like that they have two different move pools. They can do the regular move pool and they can do their Dynamax move pool. I wish I could do that. That would actually be kind of overpowered for some Pokemon. Or just barely battling a Dynamax Pokemon all on your own is pretty hard work. Of course you had no problem, Jerz. You seem like a reliable trainer too, Hop. Huh? I do? Looks like he ain't used to compliments. Look, he's got a, a grin wider than a Meowth. <laughs> I do not. Shut up. Shut up, Piers. I'll take care of the Pokemon we battled. No need for anyone to worry. It's not much of a reward, but I have a copy of my lead card. Okay, Melanie. Give me a call if anything happens. How do I call you people? This isn't like... What game was it? Was it Ruby where you had a cell phone and you could record people? And then you could call them and they'll be like, Hey man, is everything good today? Oh man, was it Ruby and Sapphire? I think it was. You had a literal cell phone and the, also in the cell phone you had a battle recorder so you could battle someone again as well. Oh man. Okay. So we got one more place, and I'm just going to keep Jerry up front. Wait, up here isn't any? There might be one at Winden after. There probably will be. I bet you do the one at Winden, you get like another Leon card. Alright. Oh man, remember this town? 
Yeah, remember? You guys remember this? We brought that letter to the guy. I wonder if he says anything now. Do you have a dear friend in your life? Make sure you treasure those. Yeah, that was one of like the creepiest things in this game. I forgot about that. Well, I forgot about it for the moment, but as soon as I saw the town, I was like, I remember this. I love this town. This is such a cool, a cool town. If I had to pick a town to live in, you know, because remember you had to make a hidden base in the old games? If I had to pick a town to live in and make a hidden base, this is my town. You! What about the Dynamax Pokemon? You think I, the elite fairy type gym leader, would have any kind of trouble? That's right, you're a gym leader now. Though I don't know about a leader or whatever. Please. Please don't tell me you came here to help. First of all, you're a bit late to be of any use. Second, I didn't need any help. Why I know you'd say why'd I know you'd say something like that? We came all the way out here just to lend a hand. What an obnoxious gym leader. The next gym challenge is shaped enough to really be something. Oliana tripped and used me. From now on, only I decide how I live. And I think that I should do now is have a battle with you. Oh crap. Uh, sorry mate, but this is hardly the time. Don't always be in such a hurry, boy. You ace my quiz, so show a little composure. BD's already quieted three Dynamax Pokemon. He's given you the luxury of some extra time. BD's life won't be bound by what other people say any longer. Although I certainly influenced a few of his decisions not too long ago. Now that you mention it, I suppose you did. <laughs> yeah, yeah, as expected of a wise 88-year-old granny, I guess. This has nothing to do with Miss Opal. This battle's for me. Now don't dilly-dally. Your only option is to accept. My Pokemon and I have risen from the ashes. I'll grant you a brief glimpse of how amazing we've become. Okay, BD. This is going to be tougher than any of the Dynamax battles, I bet you. Okay, what is this going to do to me? My days as a gym leader have made me stronger than you. Have you beaten the gym challengers, Beatty? Huh. What to do to this thing? We're gonna steel wing it. We'll, we'll stick in even though we had we were hit with intimidate. It's gonna take three steel wings. Wow, we got the buff. Defense up. What's that, lower my special defense or something? Or special attack? Special defense harshly fell. I mean, a special attack? Mawile would be something. Okay, so you did fake tears for nothing. Because then you followed up with a, with a crunch. BD, you haven't learned anything, dude. Level 61 and a gym leader for no reason. What a scrub-a-dub. Guard of Warrior. Um... That's a fairy psychic, I think. Fairy psychic. Fairy psychic. Uh, well... Mm, looks like we could do a knockoff on Tim Tim. Kind of indecisive here on what to use on this one. I think it's a fairy psychic, I'm pretty sure. Uh, nothing's very effective. If everything's just regular effective, we're just gonna go for drum beating for the stab damage. Get a little bit more damage done than usual. Perfect. One seventy one on Freya, perfect. Looking good, Gallade. Psycho Cut. Now that is more like it, baby. Psycho Cut. We don't need Slash. So we need Psychic and Fighting moves. We could do Psycho Cut and we could probably do maybe Brick Break or something. Okay, we got Psycho Cut. Rapidash. Okay, this is a Psychic Fairy. What should I do here on a Psychic? Fairy. I suppose I could stay. 
He could stay. Beauty, I know just how squishy that Pokemon is. If it survived this, I'll be very surprised. How's your Rapidash still taking it? How did it live? That better not crit, because I like to never get crits. Thank you. I'm gonna do a knockoff here, because he's probably gonna force start. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. How did I know? And I lowered its speed with that drum beating. That for a store, what is it, like 200 health? Knock off, that was not bad. Finish it off with a drum beating. The difference in damage from knock off to drum beating, my god. That stab damage is really showing. Almost one shot it before. Okay, Gallade getting some Keiko at 201 special attack. Keiko wants to learn Outrage. Nope, we don't need that. Gallade going up. Hatterene. Hatterene, Hatterene, Hatterene. That's another very something. I guess we'll jerry it up. We're trying to, we're getting, we're transitioning from dropping steel yet at some point. Once Galade hits 60, we could probably start using it. You might, you just might be the strongest champion in Galarian history. That's right. I've still got a ways to go. I'll make sure to draw out every last bit of strength from you and then triumph. Yeah, yeah. Is that a shiny? No, it didn't sparkle. Oh. I guess I thought its hat. I thought its hat was pink. Oh, there's no Dynamaxing in this battle with BD. Oh, that's right. We're fighting in the hallway. One HP. Come on, bro. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, that actually hit pretty hard. Special attack fell. I guess that's the use of that move. I could actually teach that to uh, to Freya right now. Wow. Good XP. Tim Tim, good XP, good levels. Kimler Abidi has been eliminated. And he's taking it very graceful. This must be some mistake. I mean, I'm the one who's the gym leader. 20,000 bucks. Nowhere near the 49,000 I got from the weirdos. Thank you for the battle. I can now accept you as a champion. It's painful to admit, but I've come to realize a few of my weaknesses. But I'll keep getting stronger. I'll reach the pinnacle of what fairy types can do. We got Beatty's rare lead card now. Beatty fits in with the old ladies here. They got like the hairstyle. Now then, as the gym leader, I will do my duty and clean the stadium. And that's what I would call a perfectly pink Pokemon battle. Oh, we got Opal's card too. Even if they're losing his right to participate in a challenge, Beatty still found his own way to crash the Champion Cup. Yeah, I'd say he's a force to be reckoned with. I think I get why he was chosen to be the next gym leader. He might be unbearable at times, or really, most all the time, but he's a fierce trainer. He takes things seriously. He's really strong. He's actually both. Yeah, watching him battle you, it was plain to see how much work he puts into it. He's very serious. Hey, if, if you both were gonna keep talking, how about I fetch you a nice cuppa? <laughs> God. And I won't be outdone by that BD or anyone. On to the next one. So what is next? All the stadiums are sorted. All that's left is to catch those sword and shield weirdos. If they don't find them quick, they could start this all up again. Wasn't she supposed to be looking into those... Oh yeah! Hammerlock! We gotta go back to Hammerlock, guys. Yeah, she was standing at... Uh, Hammerlock, that's your phone. It's gonna be Sonya. It's me, Sonya. The sword and shield weirdos got in the Hammerlock Stadium and are headed for the energy plant. The door to the plant's locked, but I think I can open it. Give me a bit, and you'll be able to get in here. You hear that? 
Hammerlock Stadium, get over there as soon as you can. Even over the phone, Sonya sure sounds lively. You should have heard of the Hammerlock Stadium. Okay. Alrighty. Um, so, guys, that is going to be it for this one. Thanks for watching. Uh, next time, we will uh, advance in the Hammerlock Stadium, beat up the weirdos, and uh, see how it goes from there, right? So, thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a great day and take care.